So let's talk about a fun, easy trick that you can do with world projected materials. If you make a small adjustment by going in and changing mode to masked, then on the right, you will see you now have the option to use opacity. So if you have an opacity map, you can just add another world align node up here. And when you connect it, now you have a cool new world align material that also includes transparency. And I found it to be pretty useful whenever you're trying to make some background industrial structures or really anything that doesn't require precise UVs. For example, you can turn this face into a steel graded floor. Like literally, you can take this single quad, one polygon, and turn it into an extremely detailed looking fence or prison bars. You can also turn this literal six-sided box into what looks like a crazy high poly threaded metal mesh, or even turn this block into a truss structure. And you can expand it to any size you want while the textures automatically do their thing, which is crazy because this allows us to literally use the fundamental simplest shapes known to 3D artists like boxes and quads and give them the illusion that they are much more complicated. Now, obviously it's not optimal and you'll have to make sure that things are positioned in a way that aligns with the details that you want but often you can just adjust this with a tile parameter to help you line things up. Now, if you like the transparent textures that you see here, you can always find them on my art station. But even if you make your own, I think you would be really surprised to see just how advanced you can make a single box look with this kind of trick. And the coolest part is Unreal 5's collision system still works perfectly, even though the material looks like it's transparent. So, hope that helps, and as always, hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around. Oh, 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 oh,